University Open Days are an essential element to your son or daughter's research into higher education. As parents and caregivers, your support at this time can be invaluable, providing an alternative perspective and ensuring that important questions are answered and that nothing gets overlooked. As an integral speaker to our own Open Days, we asked our Vice-Chancellor, Professor Robert Allison, to give us his best advice for those accompanying visiting students. So my tip to parents or family members attending Open Day is of course while the decision ultimately rests with the person that you're here supporting, the sorts of questions you ask, in my experience, can be the most helpful and the most probing. And of course, find out about us by walking around and meeting people and you won't go far wrong. To help you make the most of the day and plan everything that you need to see, we've compiled a list of handy tips for surviving Open Day season. Open days typically take place in June and July and then September and October, meaning that inevitably some dates will clash. Encourage your child to find out about the dates of all of their potential choices well in advance so they can be factored into your calendar. You may well find that open day visits mean travelling to new towns and cities, so planning your journey in advance is crucial. Universities should be able to provide you with detailed directions, not only to the campus but also to the relevant car parks. If you're travelling by public transport, you may well find university staff are on hand at the train and coach stations to greet you and direct you further. In the weeks preceding the event, universities will send out open day planners. These guides may arrive electronically or through the post and will contain the details of all of the talks and tours that will be taking place. There will be lots to see, so spending some time with your student, identify which sessions are priority and how you will manage your time will help make it a successful day. Higher education can be tricky to navigate, with lots of unfamiliar terminology, especially when it comes to finance. So look out for additional sessions that will be running specifically covering topics such as student funding and advice for parents and caregivers. And don't be scared to ask any questions that you may have. Visitors to open days often fall victim to the excitement of the event and everything that there is to see. So before you set out to attend, make a list of all the important information that you know your son or daughter will need in order to make an informed decision about where and what they want to study. This may be relating to work placements, industry links, facilities, extracurricular activities, studying abroad and so on. Making notes of the answers that you receive will ensure that nothing will get forgotten once you return home. Above all, enjoy the day. This is a really exciting time for both students and their families and we want you to have fun.